Hello everyone, and welcome back to another fun and exciting episode of Romance of the Three Kingdoms 14. Extreme Difficulty, one shoe playthrough. So, our perseverance held out yesterday, or no, a few days ago. And um, since I decided to stick with the game, despite that it's been highly annoying, I eventually got around to conquering Jing Province. And now I have pretty much half the world. And in doing so, the Han Dynasty given me a great rank. I am now Grand General. I am the biggest power in the land. I have, I have the most land. 22% 22.2% of the land, so I am pretty uh, big now. I should be able to defeat Yi Wan Xiao now, now that I have um, conquered his ally, Liu Billy. And now I have the strength to go up. Oops. Hmm, actually, something horrible is happening right now. It would appear that Yi Wan Xiao has other plans as well. They're going after Tao Qian. Now, I could wait a bit. Because I have done something deplorable, I have um, I have decided to go and send a messenger to Li Bu and tell him to go and get on his knees and become my sex slave. So basically, if he were to join my forces, then I would have a really powerful general to march up north with, and that's what I'm going to do. Let's see, is there any other plans I have before um, continuing? I should be able to wrap up this campaign soon. And all these are pretty loyal people, so I highly doubt I'll be able to wrap this up. <laughs> okay, alright, in that case, it's okay. I'll wait a little bit, and then I'll check out my new government orders, because uh, Boo should join. I mean, um, Sun Yu says that he will. So I, I just sent Kui Yu to go check it out. Then some, I am waiting for fresh troops to arrive. Once I get to Jian'an with those troops, I will make another march. Let's see, do we have enough people here? We have Gan Ning. Oh yeah, we have Yu Biao and pals as well. That's right, that's right. Let's see, in terms of leadership, Chen Dao, Sun Ke. Hmm. Am I sending another one to back him up, or... You know what? Maybe I should send um, Ching Wu or some some shit. Because he would be really helpful. Win Pin? Hmm. Hmm. I don't like taking officers from these guys, but they could. for a second. At 25k troops at the moment. And if I were to get this, I got 40. 46 actually. Uh, 28. Hmm. I should at least summon one. You know what? I'll just summon both of them. Fuck it. Why hold back? Holding back now would be really bad, so I'll get Ting Pu and the uh, guy over to take care of the situation real quick. Once we're done, we can leave this place once and for all. I can do some more important things up north. In fact, uh, I'll, I'll wait for now. I think having Yu Pu on my team would be very helpful for the uh, coming offensive. There are nothing special. <laughs> oh, crap. Did I forget to... Oh, I forgot to do something very important. I forgot to uh, make a nice-looking thumbnail for this. I should do that. Let me uh, find one real quick. I wonder if it'll update. Let's see...
Eh, I'll just use that old one I did before. You want you homeless? That, that, that's perfect. All right. I was like, things are getting a little quiet these days. Yeah, I mean, this game is not exactly, well, super popular. But I was expecting a little bit more. <laughs> All right, I, now that I updated it, maybe it'll work. Okay, now, let's get back into the game. Oh, wait over there, since I already made all the orders I needed to make. And I'm still waiting for troops. There's no need to reward anyone, because everyone seems to really like me now. Ah, I know what I can do. Trusted, trusted, trusted. Trusted. Let's go and start poking at these guys. And, uh, once I punch through Yuan Xiao... I can immediately ally them. Or better yet, just tell them to get on their knees and become my sex slave. It's not like I'm gonna go to war right away, so this is the best time to go in and do this. Kung Sun Zan. And I sent one to Kung Sun Du just now. Who said messenger? I would like to ally with Yuan Shu. I don't know, is that really a good idea? Oh wow, the Boo will pay me eight thousand dollars to ally. So I'm gonna say no. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> you should really be glad that you can go home alive. I say some horribly rude things. This is Yuan Shu. Say this shit to see my. So that's your answer? Well, I'm gonna go tell that shit to Ribu. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Whoop! Uh, hopefully, that doesn't make our relationship too bad. They didn't say anything about it lowering in rank. So hopefully. Oh, now I'm trusted with Kungrong as well. Now I'm friendly with Kung Sun Tu. Oh, buddy, I'm back from India. Oh, hey, Jiling, buddy, how are you, India? Oh, yeah, India is great. Hey, listen, I've got a messenger over here. You gotta talk to him. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> this dude's <is> amazing. <laughs> this dude is amazing looking. This is the <laughs> the Indian messenger. Wow, dude. <laughs> oh man, what did he give me? A politics ten book that gives extended life. I like that. Oh yeah, yeah. Go tell him to say thanks to your king. Okay, I'll go say thanks to my king, the Buddha. Goodbye. Whoop. Dude, that guy is like the living embodiment of Buddha himself. That's amazing. It's so cool. And India has got all the cool stuff. Let's see now. I am now going to send more people over. Who the hell did I send last time? I sent those two. CC. I sent Zhang He and I sent Ji Ling. Trusted officers to go perform this task. Later on, I'm gonna send. Uh... Later on, I think I'm gonna send uh... Zhang Liao over if Bu joins. Probably not Li Bu though. I need him all by my side. Oh wow, though I'm running low on food. Maybe I should cut down a little. Oh, 20,000. I'm sure you'll be okay. I'll send you a lot of troops. Oh, wait, maybe I have to. Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't know. I really don't want to part with these. These are actually good stuff. I don't know. It's, it's all right. Just, just go without treasure this time. I'm sure we'll get some later. Now, let's see here. Don't, uh, before you go, here's a reward. I oh, I'm back. Ha ha. Well, welcome back. Welcome back to uh, Romance of the Three Kingdoms. Now I'm gonna go transport some food and maybe not that much food. Some food and a little bit of troops. I already got 70,000 here, which is max. Oh, but wait a minute. I'm going to produce even more troops. I didn't need them. It's too late now. every turn. Oh, yep, I recruited fresh oh, troops. <laughs> we need more allies. Let's see. Once I get done buttering up these people, I'm going to immediately tell them to surrender to me. <laughs> uh, my strategy for this game is so grand. So one of the things about making people surrender in this game is to have massive amount of troops and to border them in some way. So once I take Puyang, I should be able to pull this off. Hopefully. Now, what is our strength in comparison to Tao Chan? I have double his number. Zhang Lu, we don't even have to discuss. Once his alliance runs out, I'm gonna go and pay him a visit. And Yu Bu, I'm already paying a visit. Good. I think it's about time I start getting ready for Pu Yang's action. Let's see, who should I send out? Again? I gotta wait for my commanders to come back, so I guess uh, Lian, you will come out. Oh, bring about 6,000. You're the support troop, and as support troop, you build things. You build things for our coming actions. Like this keep over here, for example. Actually don't need many keeps. How about this uh, catapult, for example? Actually, don't need any catapults. All right, we can build a keep there. See, the problem with this game is that. Well, actually, hold on. Maybe I can tear this to shreds and build a uh, a keep. Yeah, that's what I do. The problem with this game is that there's not enough places to build buildings sometimes. So they want us to be strategic, and yet there's not enough room to be strategic. Not enough freedom. So I want to build some like trebuchets or catapults around the city. I can't do that. I can't use those to siege the city. 
because that would be too much for the AI to handle. <laughs> the thumbnail's so sad. Well, that's Yuan Chu for you. Yuan Chu is a sad person. Yuan Chu is exceedingly sad. You know, right now, you can't even force someone out of a apartments or anything like that. What's this? Hmm. All right, I'll take it because right now. I, Kui Yur, as a messenger of Yuan Shu, has something very important to tell you. Or, you know, what do you want? Oh, if you don't want to fight, why don't you go and surrender to I, Yuan Shu Army? Please think about it. Wow, we can't take that. Our whole army's gonna collapse. Ugh, fine, I'll join Yuan Shu's forces. Oh great! You are so smart! That's the greatest decision you'll ever make. I promise you that. And so Li Bu's forces collapsed. And now we can trade with Rome. Also known as Da Chun. Big Chun. It's like the Chun Dynasty, except it's big! Oh, hey. Now I am Da Sima. And yes, I am fluent. Grand Commandant, how wonderful. <laughs> Perfect, just in time, too. Now I can. Now I can do a number of things. I can give ranking to. Say the likes of Li Bu. Oh, wait, he needs to go back home first. Wait. Yes, for now, I'll make Cao Cao general of the rear. See, Ma Yi, huh? Did I give Si Ma Yi? Eh, see why you should do this one. It's too bad that all my um, most important strategists and such are, are busy doing something, otherwise I'd promote them right now. Alright. General on the left. Zhang Liao. General on the right? Xiao Yun? No, 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 no. How about we do it like this? Uh, let's let's give those ranks to um, Xiao Yun later. Yeah, for now we'll give it to. Uh, no, wait, no. That's not a good idea. Well, let's do it like this. For now, Zhang Liao will uh, we'll have no rank because uh, I'm gonna need him for something. I need him to go on adventures for me, because then he can get more stats. This I'm saving for Yu Bu when he comes back. Then... Liu Yi's current position is fine for his current stats. I give Cao Cao that normally, but... This guy. He's already got a rank. Shit. Lu Ji. Interesting. Uh... Alright, I'd like Lu Ji enough to give him this rank. Now I need to fill in this rank with some other people. I 
guess I'll give Jonga this rank for now. So now, Zhang Liao and Gao Shun are the ones who pacify so the east and the north. Now, to give gifts to people. Thank you. for conquering sea province. <laughs> this is the capital province, so I'm very glad to have taken it. Now, with the current situation, I believe it would be wise to start transporting some stuff over. For now, I want you all to manage army sure. stuff. I want you to create troops for me. And I ran out of commands. Shit. Homeless Rat Emperor. <laughs> I don't know if you can marry outside of events, though. Oh, hey, Fatsun found his way in here. Let's see. I'll give him a rank soon. Not now. Who can I give gifts to? Hmm. Ah, who's back? Good. Now I can give him that rank. I'm saving this rank so that <clears throat> when Xiao Dun comes back, he'll be general the left uh, and the right with Xiao Yuan. I can set him up for battle. It seems like Yuan Xiao is attacking this place at full force. Sure. Now would be a great time to begin planning our move to take over. Sure. To take over Puyang. I think it's about time we get started. Once, uh. Actually, are they back now? Oh, good. Let's send them out now. Shit, I think Cao Cao is out. Cao Cao can lead 15,000 troops. Build a keep along with the Yen. Now, I need to get a couple officers over. Si Mai, for example. 
庄了，夏侯渊，高树，吕布。出发！我出发了。Will reinforce the gate over there, real quick. 朱 Jun's recruiter, Wei Zhu's trainer. I know. I'll set up a base camp here at Luoyang. Hmm. Crap. I was actually going to send Zhang Liao on a trip to Rome. I suppose I could wait a little. Ninety-four thousand gold. Don't mind if I do. I will take about half of it. Thank you. That's a lot of food. I'll take those as well. Let's stash them over here. Zhiko Jicheng. Lu Bu has been amassing wealth all this time. Probably don't need to have anyone here. I'm going to go. Lu Ji is the commander here. And who else is here to back him up? Shit. Xiao Yuan. Okay, those guys should be able to hold the keep. Good. Once I send troops over, it'll be okay. Yeah. Now my next move is to get ready to move out from Tanlao. That should be it now. Treasures. Holy shit! What is up with all this treasure? Okay, I gotta give some treasure out before we uh, begin <clears throat> sending them out for battle. What is this? We got raided. That's Jiling and Zhonghe, for example. They're actually good. Someone just died. Who is it? Zhongqiao just died. Oh shit! Damn it! Yeah, it seems like now is the best time for Fuyang. Let's go. Not gonna wait much longer. Let me just uh, give some stuff away. Everything be okay. Oh. Give you back your red hair. Give you back your halberd. Oh, hey. When did I... I guess he came with it. How interesting. I guess he liked him enough that he gave him that treasure. 
Well, if it's on him already, I guess I'll keep it on him. So whoever gets this bowl will have 10 extra strength. Let's see. Nah, I'm not gonna do that yet. I want to give it to Zhang Liao or something. Also, there's apparently a command to search in uh, Luoyang, so I'll just go ahead and do that real quick, too. No, wait, no, 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 bad idea, bad idea. I'll send only a few guys. Because after all, I gotta actually start attacking now. Boom. My best officers are still not here yet. Still, I'll send Wu out to um, deal with the enemy forces together with Cao Cao. For the moment. As a matter of fact, why don't we go and actually help out our ally? Instead of watching them die like a bunch of pricks, we're going to actually help out our allies. I mean, sure, yeah, it'd be great if they enter the castle and all that, but I think mm. it'd be better Dunda. if we help them out. Get Get and the next turn, I can wait for my best officers to arrive and uh, continue my attack. But wait a minute, what the hell is this? I need to send someone over to um, to Rome now. I can't wait. Let's see who to send. But I need these guys to fight soon. I have to. I guess Rome will have to wait a little bit. I need to send people to Rome, but not right at this moment. Maybe next turn. These guys will arrive soon. All right, good. Oh shit, there's one other thing I need to do. <laughs> I need to combine Yu and Xia Dun so that they have um, level 5 war on everything. I need to make sure I have that before going to war. So now I have level 5 troops everywhere. This is four, five, seven. Need three more. If we can get that three more now. Six. No, oh, this is level ten. Oh, that's right. Tal Tal, that's right, that's right, that's right. So three, four. This is 10, 10, 9, 9. Right, just give me a second. I need to make sure I have everything in order here. This is a lot of extra, extra work. Oh, hey, yeah, that's right. I have Sun Yu and I have uh, Lu Ji. Those would be perfect. Oh, and then I went over here. Oh, but wait a minute, he's my... Never mind, I, I never needed to do that in the first place. G. There we go. This is for internal politics, or internal affairs. This is for uh, people, personnel. I ran out of points, so these will do.
Alright, go. Now I can finally end turn. God damn it, that turn took a little longer than I thought. Xu Huang just immediately joins. Han Xun. Oh wow, they're all attacking Tao Chan at the moment. I think helping them out now is actually the most prudent choice. That way I can attack them from behind while they're in the middle of attacking Tao Chan's stuff. Because I am for sure going to be enemies with the evil forces of uh, Yuan Shao. There's no way we're ever going to be friends. But we could see my long. Let's set ranks. I'm gonna give this bow to Zhang Liao because Zhang Liao is really good. I like Zhang Liao a lot. With this bow, Zhang Liao has basically a plus 10 weapon and a horse at the same exact time. Actually, a really deplorable, deplorable setup. And now, should I send him out to go to Rome or? I like to build them up, but I also think that I need... Here, here's what I'll do. I'll send Xu Wang over. Oh, fuck it. I'll send Lu Ji. It's not like they're going to come over here anytime soon. Then I will give Rome 10,000 gold. Give Rome... Uh, maybe not 50,000. Eh, you know what? Lu Ji just give him 50,000. I'll even give them a vase. There. Once Rome receive this, they'll guarantee to give me something nice. I think. No, well, now I really want to send Zhang Liao over. Because he'll probably gain a lot of stats from doing this. Hundred and twenty days to Rome though. Nah, forget it. Forget it. I want to so bad, but I really shouldn't because I need them for this battle. Next time. Next time I'll have a chance. Alright, Gao Shun, Zhang Liao, Sima Yi. Let's go. Gao Shun uses battering rams. See, my uses catapult. I will meet at the checkpoint here and get ready to attack. I wish the power up kit let the swing play as an officer. Now there's an ah, they still haven't fucking arrived yet. Motherfuckers, you're so slow. Next time, then. All right, now to help out our allies before they turn into mincemeat. <laughs> hmm. Go slaughter them all. Nope. Wong 
中年，像红蹲下去。There, we made it. I don't think they they will be able to survive now that we attacked them from behind. Oh, we didn't just make it. We cut their supply route while we're at it. Now they are well and truly fucked. They are well and truly fucked now. I don't think they'll be able to come back after that one. All right, next move. Uh, I bet they didn't expect a bunch of fucking assholes to suddenly showing up and ruin their day. All right, now Xiao Houtun and Xiao Yuan will be left and right generals, respectively. We're not gonna recruit Han Xuan. That's just silly. But what we will do is send our buddies. Oh, we can send four people over now? Don't be kidding me. Five people. Oh, oh Lord! I didn't even realize we can send five messengers over now. Thirty thousand. Oh, no, that's still too cheap. Fifty thousand. I even gave him a something. Uh, I can't give them any more stuff now. These I need them to, to give to my officers, because my officers are very important. So that is how we will do this. Alright, so Yuan Xiao's forces have arrived. They're likely backing them up. Backing their assault force up. We will park our siege weapons here while we ruinate everyone here and protect our allies. Once our allies are safe, we will then make a move for Puyang. This should be the last stream of Yuan Shao's forces. It seems like Yuan Shao's forces also has to deal with some uh, people attacking from behind. I have two more months. Two more months with Tao Qian? Oh shit, I need to get out of there soon. I mean, I guess I could try to ally him longer. But I also want to just straight up make him surrender. <laughs> if I can do that, that would be uh, very helpful. Now to go and make friends with these people so that I can eventually make him surrender as well. Alright, so after we're done here, we shouldn't stay for very long. We should wrap up and leave. In fact, Xiao Yuan and Zhang Liao will stay here and we'll get ready to move in a second. After we wipe out these guys in a single turn, we will return and um, get ready for our own attack in Puyang. Meanwhile, Jian'an is ready to launch troops. Let's go. I had these guys prepare all this time just for this situation. We got six thousand troops left. We act as support troop. Sixteen movement. 11 movement, 11 movement. Uh, go with arrows. Chen Dao. You know what, Chen Dao? Don't worry about it. Don't You don't have to come. There. Nice even numbers across the board. We should be able to do this. Two siege weapons, an escort, and an archer. Oh, 
That should be more than enough to take over that place. Should be able to take Hui Ji. Now in the coming turn we'll take Wu. And then the evil forces of Yan Bai Hu will be no more. Alright, well our forces march. Let's go. Let's see what Cao Cao and Wu will do to the Guan Yu and Pals. No, this is not an RTS. RTS is real time. What the hell is this? Yuan Shao, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? They just... They just started the Anti-Yuan Yuan Shu Alliance. Anti-Yuan Shu Alliance. Out of nowhere. With these people that I was just buttering up. That's just wonderful. Now I guess I can't butter up with them anymore. But Gong Soon Du is still going to be our buddy, so let's send some money over to him. Hell, let's not be cheap, because he's willing to still be our friend after all that. But these guys, mm -mm, they're no good. They're, they're now part of the anti-Yuan Shu alliance. Though the anti-Yuan Shu alliance is kind of silly. I mean, look at this. It's just Li Zhi, Ma, Chao, uh, Ma Tang, Zhang Yang, Yuan Shao, Gong Sun Zhan, <laughs> Liu Yu. For Gong Sun Zhan to work together with Yuan Shao, things must be terrible indeed. Oh, and Yan Bai Hu as well. But Yan Bai Hu, he can, he can suck my dick. So yeah, um, apparently there's an anti Yuan Shu alliance, but luckily for me, I prepared ahead of time and made allies with these people. So, you know, Yuan Yuan Shao saw what I did to his troops. Me saving my ally, he got very upset with that. But you know, he brought that onto himself. Attacking my ally is a big no-go. Big no -go. They have set up 34,000 troops here. I hope we have enough to uh, take care of it. For now, what we're going to do, in fact, is return here to go back to our keep. <laughs> anti Yuan Shu Alliance. This is the first time I've ever seen something so ridiculous. Mm. Mm -hmm. It is an, indeed a useless alliance, just like what he did with Dong Zhuo. Yeah. Indeed, indeed. That's why I'm not even phased. I, I think that's kind of amusing. Wang Yuan? I need more troops. I need more troops. In fact, I need more gold too. Give me more of that. More food as well. We need more of everything, because uh, we're doing some serious war now. Hmm, Xu Chang has a lot, num large number of stuff. Let's go and have them ship that shit over as well. Ship all your troops, your money, your motorcycle, everything. Because we're getting ready to wrap up this campaign. First, I need to get out of this area. I can't allow myself to remain in ally lands when our alliance runs out. I don't know what will happen if um, our alliance runs out. If he'll join the enemy alliance or if he will just... Uh... Technique, but Zhang Liao's in trouble. He's running out of troops. Still, I need cover. Send the end to back him up. And now we will send Yu Bu and Cao Cao to back up Zhang Liao. 
Shahu Yuan from behind. Hopefully that'll work out. Meanwhile, we have Tao shooting at them. So that's going to be a pretty uh, clean run, hopefully. Do we need more officers? Let's see. If we were to launch now, what kind of guys will we get? Gong. Hmm. All right, let's get a couple more uh, of our best officers over. Let's see. So they're kind of busy with one thing or another. We should keep those guys south. It's okay, it's all right. I will take Lockjun over though, because we're gonna need need some help with that. Meanwhile, our buddy Wayan charges all the way ahead all by himself because that's what he does. And we're just gonna have him uh, cap nearby territories real quick. And you, when you get over here, build yourself a keep. Oh, I'm so glad I allied with those guys before they uh, became enemies. Honestly, I should have sent guys over to these two far earlier. If I had, they wouldn't have joined as well. But luckily for me, Gong Soon Du, I did manage to come in contact a little earlier. In fact, if I were to get rid of one Shao, the Alliance would just collapse in on itself, right? That's what would happen, right? Also, I'm gonna go and poach one of your guys. For no other reason other than shits and giggles. Let's go! <clears throat> Strategy in motion. go. Li Bu versus Yan Liang. Being weak is wrong. You are wrong to be weak. Another duel? But why? How did this happen? In the end versus Yan Liang. I gave Yan Liang a wound, and now it turned into an even, uh, not even, an uneven fight, but it's in, uh, a little more balance, I suppose. Yan Liang otherwise would have overwhelmed the end. And oh shit! You just knocked his ass down. I guess that's what he gets challenging you to a duel, being wounded, you captured him. Wow, you're amazing! I can't believe you captured me, Yan Liang. He goes into your pocket. He goes. He goes into your pocket. Yeah, I'm playing this via Steam right now. Xiao Yuan and Wu will go and attack Wen Chou. Zhang Fei is on his way over. I do believe now is an opportunity to go. Oh, actually, I lied. That's not an opportunity at all. There's like 18,000 troops left. We need to uh, stay nearby for now. We need to wait for um, more of their troops die. Uh, 
Oh, the enemy is also coming in force from over here as well. Maybe we should start building boats. No, maybe we should start building big boats. Like, really big boats. Like, like huge boats. Maybe we should consider doing that. Tai Mao and Zhou Tong also could do that. But I need to get to level 10 in order to get, like, frigates. <sighs> if only I have an extra slot. I only have two slots in terms of personnel. I can't do it. Guess I'll have to wait. I want to build big boats. If I had big boats in this river, I'd kick their asses. Because if, if they so much as touched this river, I would fuck them up. <laughs> Xiao Tun, this book guy. Xiao Tun went on a stupid trip right now. He's going to Parthia at the moment. Oh, what is this? Don't buy. What I need you to do is just sit here and shoot. In fact, I need some good people who can, uh, who are good at this arrow stuff, but keep shooting at them. Run Chao Sing. <laughs> Chao Sing. Yeah, let's send Chao Sing over. He'll shoot off. No, but then again, his leadership is low. Hmm. Alright, alright, I'll sing it is, I'll sing it is. I need to defend this gate from the evil forces of Dongbai. Until then... What is our alliance like with Tao Qian? We have one month of alliance remaining. Tao Qian has just recently lost the city to San Yu. The San Yu apparently is... EXTREMELY unhappy with Tao Qian and just took their city, burned it to the ground, and walked away. Are you even kidding me, dude? Just took their stuff and walked away. The fuck, man? It's not natural. Just broke their shit and just walked away. Alright, now... I don't think I have any other commands for this turn because I still need to wait for troops to arrive. So it's time to go. On. I think the PUK is pretty decent. It's not so bad. Looks like the trip to Anshi worked out nicely. Oh. <laughs> Slaughter them all. And so he did. Including our own allies, because that's the way who does things, I guess. Went to die. Jiling and pals have made it to India. All right, let's see if I can't convince him to surrender. Shit. All right, guess we're not going to be able to um, make him surrender yet. So, another 24 months then. It would be great if he surrenders, because then I can use all of his power 
but, well, his power level is apparently not low enough for that kind of stuff. Not Tulsing, fuck that, I need to use him. Send another two. soon do. Alright, now we're gonna get Tulsing to come out. Hopefully you can shoot out an eyeball or two while uh, the Juris forces are coming. If we can hold back don't buy now, that would be very handy. So let's do that. Because I'm a little too busy here with uh, Yuan Shao. There's still a lot of troops here. But are we able to build a keep here despite all that? Let's see. Let's do that. Mm. 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 We're building a keep here. Alright, now our siege weapons. Forward march. Get ready to siege. Our supplies have arrived, some of it. Oh shit, Lockton needs to get a rank. I'll give him a rank in a second. I'd wait one more day, but it takes too long, so I'm just going to send Zhang Liao over now to help back up the situation. Now I need to make sure I give a rank to poor Lok Chun. Give him something to play with. Otherwise, he has no troops. these territories with these soldiers for now. Alright, let's go back to the main battlefield. Carol! Yes, it was Carol. Oh, wow. Are you kidding me? Zhang Fei duels Chao Chao? That's not even fair. That's not even... Oh, wait, wait, wait. What the hell happened? He's wounded. 79 versus 79. <laughs> That's deplorable. Tao Tao rules, don't they?
Oh my god, he just dueled Zhang Fei and won. That's the most deplorable thing I've ever gotten to see. That is the most deplorable thing I've ever gotten to see. Jesus Christ, man. I can't believe something so deplorable just happened. That was extremely deplorable. Because I, Yuan Shu, should go and defend my territories. Because right now, the evil Liu Bei is on his way over to tr try to cap my land. I can't accept that. Hey, who the fuck does this Liu Bei think he is? He'll kick his ass and then immediately move, move on to the north. Liu Bei. And Kwai Gan Xing. Quan Chiu. Quan Chiu Xing. So I'm just gonna call him Kwai Gan Xing. Meanwhile, it's the situation here. The Tong Gate seems to be holding, but I'm not entirely sure for how long. This is kind of the floor. Should I ask for more outside help? Wei Yuan in the end, huh? I guess I could give it to, uh, to these two, but they're new. I shouldn't do that. Let's give uh, Shu Zhu and hey, your your thing is canceled. Cancel. Shu Zhu, I will cancel too. Shu Zhu can instead go up here. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Do it with the end wave. Perfect. Then. Wei Year and Cheng Lian can serve as temporary officers for the uh, coming assault, I suppose. Setting ranks is a pain in the ass. I wish I there's a better way to do it but for now. Oh. Oh, no event. What's happening? Oh! Ask the Chung to fight! Let's see. We don't have any territories in Liang. Tan Lao's money is greater or equal to 80,000. Oh, okay then. We'll ask the Chung to help out. In order to spread his influence to the southwestern corridor, uh, no, 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 northwestern corridor, Yuan Shu, before he goes after Liang Zhou, plans to do this. See, we're about to fight Li Zhu's army in Liang Zhou. What should we do? Why don't we go and use the Chang to help us? That way, we don't need to spend any soldiers or anything, and we can weaken nature's power. But that is the plan called to use someone's blade to cut them down. Someone else's blade, how interesting. Okay, we'll use, but are you sure that the Chang will willing to help us? Oh sure, just give him some money. Everybody loves money. Oh yeah, money, perfect. Yeah, great idea. Hey, Mr. Chang Chief, I come to represent my Lord Yuan Shu. 
Oh, oh yeah, what the fuck does Yuan Shu want? Oh, I just came here to uh, ask you to go oh, uh, attack Liang Zhou a little bit. No problem, right? Of course, we're not gonna have you leave empty-handed. Here's a little bit of a gift. What do you think? Oh, wow, Jesus Christ, all that money? Just for me? You sure know how to do business, my boy. Oh, yeah, definitely. Now, let's go kick their ass. Yeah, we're gonna kick their ass. And so the evil Chang decides to march out upon my request to fight the Jur from behind. And that is deplorable. They actually sent troops almost immediately. Oh shit, they're even sending more troops! 60,000 troops? Oh shit, son! You're gonna be in trouble now if you keep fighting me here. That, that would be a very big mistake for you if you stay here. Because you're about to get fucked. Yeah, you're, you're about to receive the biggest fucking. Oh, you're big, making a big mistake, boy. Big mistake. Shouldn't have done that. Now you're going to pay for it. Big mistake. Mm -mm, big mistake. Shouldn't have done that. Terrible mistake. Terrible, terrible mistake. For that. <laughs> I'm actually very interested to see what's going to happen over there. You know what? Uh, let's see. Uh, we're still building this keep and stationing our troops. Oh, you know what? Hold on. We should wait. Let's wait 10 days. Let's wait 10 days. We shouldn't wait because this is an important base mission. We fuck it up, we all go straight to hell and then we die. So uh, I like to not die, so let's uh, do this a little more cautiously. Therefore, we're going to see what those evil Chang is doing with their 60,000 troops. Oh, but wait, shit. Another thing I need to check on real quick. Looks like gunning is about to be done here. And we're ready to make an assault as well. Man, these barbarians sure are uh, pretty rude when they want to, huh? Let's see that 60,000 troops only are sending out. Whoop! Oh, Lord, that is scary as hell. Oh, my Lord. Dude, they'll conquer the whole place all by themselves. Oh, my Lord. God, that's disgusting. Look at this. That's not normal, man. <laughs> that's not no normal. <laughs> that's not normal. <laughs> that's not normal. <laughs> that's not normal, man. That's fucked up. <laughs> oh my god, they're gonna get destroyed. This city only has like 8,000 people. Meanwhile, how'd the gate go? The gate seems to be holding on, but we are on fire! We are on fire! Excuse me, we're on fire! Uh, let's walk over here. And you walk over here, just avoid the fire. The gate seems to be uh, holding, holding nice and all. Hey, what the hell is this guy doing? He's just building a wall! While we're fighting, he just goes around and builds a wall? What in the hell is this? And Liu Bei has begun battle. Our siege weapons have made it. We're ready to siege. And now, getting ready to uh, protect our forces over here. As soon as somebody comes out, we boo and pals are swarm them. Otherwise, the siege weapons will make their own move. And... The southeast, our keep is completed, so now we're ready for an assault. Enemy cities within this range, so we'll sit by, and if someone comes out to try to stop us, Wei Yan! We'll teach him a lesson. Wei Yan, also known as Legion. Alright, 
so now we're going to slow down time a little so we can see all kinds of weird shit. Wow, Jesus Christ, man. You do this shit to Yuan Shu, the Rat Emperor? Are you gonna help me or are you just gonna sit here? Oh, there we go. Okay, maybe one is a little too slow. Let's do two. Okay, now we have the evil Liu Bei surrounded. Oh! Liu Bei and Yuan Shu duels! Liu Bei versus Yuan Shu? Rats versus rats. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the floor. Oh no, Yuan Shu is losing. Oh, here's Yuan Shu Muso attack. Oh, oh. Oh. I lost. What the fuck? How did I lose? I thought I won. <laughs> It was even too, what the fuck? I am wounded now. You fucking... <laughs> you cheated, Liu Bei. You cheated. You fuck. You cheated. You cheated. I clearly had you. You fuck. <laughs> oh god, that's deplorable. Our siege weapons are approaching Buyang. They'll take a little bit of time. Meanwhile, Feng Gate. Seems like the gate still holds. Barbs are just hanging around outside Tian Sui. Oh, they're also attacking Zhang Lu. How wonderful. And now from Tong Gate, let's send out Wei Yu. 8,000 troops. 8,000 shock troops. Scare the fuck out of them. Oops. So here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna send 8,000 shock troops, kill them, then immediately go back to base. Pretty simple, right? That's what you do in history, after all. Wei Yi and Chen Lian, when um, Lu Bu had joined Yuan Shao, they were fighting the Heishan bandits, and they did the shit where they attacked uh, Zhang Yan's base like 15,000 times, just charging in and out and in and out, until they got so tired they gave up the base. So that's uh, what I'm gonna have them do here as well. Except this time they're doing it on defense. It looks like Onichan is on his way here. Yuan Shao is coming with his buddy Gao Gan. And this will be very interesting. Well, I'm still gonna stick with my battle against Liu Bei. Because I just I used use, use chaos technique and confused him. about down here. It seems like the siege weapons have already begun battle. Alright, good. I don't know what the Sun Yur is planning, but they, they don't seem to be... Oh, wow, what the fuck happened here? That's not normal. That's not normal. I can't have that. We'll, we'll fix that later. All right, now let us go and continue watching the glorious battle of Yuan Chu, Yuan Rat. What the? Hey, listen, dude, we're buddies, right? Let's extend our alliance. Another twenty-three months. He'll even pay me for it. Okay, all right. Well, if you're so willing, then let's do it. 
do like. Yuan Shu has friends, man. Even though there's an anti Yuan Shu alliance, he has friends. And now there's Tao Chen with 35 months worth of alliance. That's deplorable. Though Tao Chen, despite what the Romance of Three Kingdoms may tell you, he's actually an incredibly evil man. So I could see why he'd be buddy buddy with a guy named Yu Yu Yeah, you guys should answer. That'd be more interesting if you do. It'd be like a pop quiz. All right, let's go. One Chu versus Liu Bei. Yeah, he healed his troops. Meanwhile, Wei Ji is having some problems with their walls. We get to see the walls again. It seems like they're not sending any troops out to stop us. You may die! Luigi has fallen. All 10,000 troops has been defeated. Oh, now we can trade with the year. Hey, you captured these guys? They don't want to join? Put them in the prison. What about the gate? It looks like Wei Yir has defeated the enemy siege weapon and continues to fight. There's a huge ass fire here. Meanwhile, our support troops is building towers and walls for no reason. I like that. That amuses me. But I don't think that's necessary. We should ask for some troops now. <coughs> Not you, you're the recruiter. Here, Cai Zhong, you do it. I want you to bring troops here to congregate. Unan, do the same thing. Congregate here. So we need to send troops to Tong Gate, or Luoyang at the very least, so that we can get ready to attack Chang'an. Sun Year, let's be friends with them. But who should we send? Baba. Let's give the Sun Year some money. I like to see what kind of nonsense they'll give me for being their friends. So, you wanted to know who my allies are. My allies are Liu Yan, Tao Qian, Sun Te, Zhang Lu, not Kung Sun Du, but he's our friend. And Kong Rong. That's our uh, buddies for this round. I hope to uh, be able to convince Sun Tzu to surrender because I need him and his power to the north. <laughs> Meanwhile, everyone, go inside Hui Ji. Let's go. <laughs> 58. Since we have a lot of battles to do, we'll buy some food. We don't need all this money. Now I want you to transport this food. And a little bit of the money. Hui Ji. 
because we need this food in order to continue our assault. If we run out of food in the middle of a campaign, that would be highly embarrassing. That would be something that we don't want to do. We don't want to do something like, like that. That would be really embarrassing. Oops. Uh, let's see. Like this. While we wait for everyone to arrive, we can start governing this land. Let's see. For now, why don't you build some barracks? Because we need to uh, make sure we have more troops being prepared. Are you kidding me? All of our support troops have been defeated? What the fuck happened? How did this happen? All of our troops have been defeated? What the hell happened when I wasn't looking? Well, that's not good. Let's, uh, let's get out of here. What the fuck happened? I had like all these troops and all of a sudden I don't have these troops anymore. What the hell happened? Sure. I'm actually kind of eager to see what But I'm guessing, I'm generally guessing, is that we probably charged in against Guan Yu and then get shot in by arrows or something. Or he activated his skill right away. Whereas we didn't activate any of our skills. That sort of stuff. No sure, ma. You guys are not doing any damage against the place. Ah, <laughs> that's terrible. You're not even shooting at anything. God damn, you had a bunch of troops and you're not doing anything with them. I can't believe this shit. I had all these troops there ready to attack Kuyang and then all of a sudden I lost them all. I even had a keep and everything built. How the fuck did this happen? Shit. Kuyang is so much harder to take than I thought. It's probably because of all this bullshit territory as well as trees and shit. Uh. It's gonna take a while before I can grow enough troops to come back again. This is shit. Oh, hey, something is happening. 
become friends with Sanyu. Now Sanyu messenger came to visit me. They suddenly sent a messenger? Oh man, I hope it's nothing bad. No, 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 no. They wish to be friends with us. Oh, hey, so now the Sanyur sent some of their officers to join me. Two fierce Sanyur officers just joined my forces. Our supplies currently sits at 25,000. We have to wait until... We have to wait until um, some reinforcements come before we can do anything. So for now, just do some training and raising of troops. And after a certain period of time, once the supplies arrive, we will go north again. Meanwhile, since we recently just got fucked in the ass, why don't we use this opportunity to go and send some people over to, uh... To, like, India or something. You five will make a trip to India. Jing Zunming. Meanwhile, let's get the fuck back. We'll have to defend for a bit. Because for some fucking reason, we keep throwing troops at Puyang, and it keeps getting us killed. No, you can't recruit anyone, but you can trade with them. Once again, though, we're going to have to um, build up. Home Gate has finished their battles. So I'm going back in. Meanwhile, we have some weird shit going on. They're just building all this crap next to Chang'an for some reason. Meanwhile, these barbs that came out, they're not doing a point of damage to Tian Sui. They're just charging against the wall. They have no siege weapons. So that's kind of silly. Alliance with Sun Tzu runs out in two months. I should send him a message for surrender soon. Now, that stupid battle at Puyang took a lot of my troops, so uh, now I'm... 217,000. Kongrong has nothing. Tao Qian has nothing. Honestly, <laughs> Yuan Xiao himself lost a considerable amount of troops as well. Ten thousand, ten thousand, ten thousand. Majority of my troops are congregated in these areas.
Well, I guess I'll wait for a bit then. <clears throat> Oh, I made Zhao Province surrender to me. I have a How the hell am I ever going to take Puyang? I go for a siege attack, it didn't work out. It's just... The enemy just has so much higher stats than me. 3,000 attack, like are you fucking kidding me dude? 3,000 defense? Like I'm dealing with the ultimate shield and the ultimate sword. Alright, I think I, I can't just do a direct assault, this just never works. I have to make sure I cap like almost all the territories before I try it. Shit. I wonder if I could get, um, Gaoshun back. Well, now I have to wait a little bit of time before I can do anything. I lost way too many troops in the last couple of battles. This checkpoint is just way too hard to take. Now I have to wait until all my shit here is taken care of. Deplorable. Nobody. Let's use this chance to make friends with Sun here. Send them to me. Oh, yeah, there they are. Son, your brave general. I'm your brave soldier. Brave fighter. Their stats are pretty average, but I'm sure they'll send me better ones once I get um, higher rank with them. Still, it's free guys. I can't complain. You throw Gord and my problems. That's what I've been doing, dude. I've been throwing a lot of Gord for my problems. In fact, that's all I've been doing, throwing Gord at my problem. Oh yeah, let's make Zhang Zhao angry with his lord. Maybe then I can actually have him surrender the territory to me. Because, yeah, I'm uh, just going to throw Gord at my problems. 
Meanwhile, the barbarians that came out, they did a whole bunch of nothing. And now they're gonna be driven away for no reason. That's the most deplorable thing. Oh well. No, you don't. You have to wait. It takes 10,000 years. Chaoxiu and Palace of Maiden. Hey, I've got a guitar. Look at him. Hey, look at that. I've got this snake killing blade. It's 10 more. Wow, there's a lot of cool stuff in this place. Joshin. Well, now they're coming to attack again. After driving us off, they're going to, for a counterattack. Hey, Liu Hu, would you like to go and sweep them aside for me? Really nice. I want you to send all these guys to the graveyard. You can handle killing all these men all by yourself? Yeah, send them all to the graveyard. Sending Liu Bu now with 11k to do this. Send the, all these men to the graveyard. Looks like Hui Ji has some searching going on. Hold on a second. Before I do that, I need to go visit the Sun Yur again. Hey, buddy, give him more money. What's your dollar? And what the barbarians like? They want, like, fucking money. Give him more. Let's see. Supply transport should be there in about... a few more days. <coughs> Alliance with Sun Tzu. One more month. Just in case they do something silly, though, like taking our land before we can do anything about it. Why don't we send a guy with... Oh, nope, nobody's got that. Very well, you send me. Some guys over. Go to Hulao Gate and just park there for a bit. I don't want some dude to just randomly attack Hulao Gate and take it. Because that would be pretty nasty. I don't want to deal with that. Looks like we're to do two shipments because I don't think I can afford to wait. Let's go and send some troops now. Supplies ready. Then I'll defend on the right side, which I have planted all this garbage on. Surely we can defend. But yeah, that's pretty much how it is with Yuan Shao right now. We fight. The attacker loses. Then the defender tries to counterattack. Then the counterattack loses. And then we go right back to where we were started again. Nobody seems to be able to gain upper hand over here at Guangdu. It's amazing.
Yuanshu doesn't even have the Imperial Seal in this game. He needs to get it. I have to make Suncha surrender to me. Friends with the Sun Yu. Being friends with Sun Yu, too. Oh, hey, uh, Lord Yuan Shu, the Sun Yu leader wants to see you. Will the leader come here by himself? I hope that's nothing bad. Hey, I'm Big Son, your leader. I got something to say to you. <laughs> that's great. I'm so glad you're here. Hey, your soldiers are strong too. Hey, you know, uh, you want to join and, you know, show the world how uh, friendly we are with each other? Oh, yeah, that definitely do that. Yeah. Okay, that's right. Well, from now on, us, Son, your are now yours to command. Well, we are now... <coughs> We're now buddies, don't forget. Alright, goodbye. <coughs> I like that. Son, you are so friendly. You wouldn't think that they're barbarians. Oh, hey! There's actually a, a Gong Sun Zan event where Gong Sun Zan kills Liu Yu. But uh, we will skip that. I want to see something else. I want to see what happens with the Sun Yu. Is that like... to wait 18 turns and make sure that our morale in our main city is 100 or higher. I see, I see. And then we can be friends with the Sun Yu even more. In other words, take your time. Okay, got it. Meanwhile, Liu Bu is handling these guys all by himself. And Guan Yu and Taos are here to make a sieging counterattack. Yan Bai, who took over this land and is doing some weird shit. And our supplies are about to make it. Well, while Yan Bai, who is busy doing that shit, I'll take his Wu. Then. The southern part of the map should be pacified. Sun Tzu, 69,000. I actually don't know if I can make him surrender. 69,000 is considerable. Making Zhang Lu surrender is one thing. Or Gong Rong surrender is one thing. But uh, Sun Te might need a little more convincing. We'll see what happens. Good, you guys can make Zhang Zhao mad at one shell. I hope you guys can actually pull this through because I'm really sick and tired of that fucking place. I don't want to deal with it anymore. 
You guys can just make it so that it surrenders. That would be really nice. Just throw gold at my problem. I mean, we've heard this before. That is what we're going to do. Oh, but Kui, Kui Yur is like really far away. Man, Kui Yur is like really good. He's, maybe I should bring him to Tano or something. You know what? I think that's what I'll do. Apparently, Kui Yur is uh, really good at this stuff. Yeah, I might as well get Kui Liang to join me as well. Apparently, smart people enjoys doing smart things. Oh, you get Del time to come. Then we will try to use tactics to weaken Yan a little bit. Now, we will drag people here who has nothing better to do and colonize this area. Because believe me, we have a lot of colonizing to do. No, not, not these guys. Though. These guys are busy. You see my long. No, actually not these guys too. These guys are good. Wait, 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 wait. Good guy. You seven will colonize this land. Once you arrive, you'll take over. Then we'll go and take Wu and other places. Then afterwards, I'll leave the AI in control of this place. Sounds good to me. I already conquered China. Ooh, that was like one of the earlier playthroughs in English. Looks like our trip to uh, India is going well. I like how that fucking Ribu just cut off their supplies while they're while they're attacking. Ooh, what an asshole! Now that their supplies are gone, Ribu is going to kill the last one of them. One shell's in trouble. And Yu Fu is just sweeping them aside. It's disgusting. Oh, man, so kick their ass and then go home. How's our supplies handling? I say next turn to arrive? Good. Once the supplies arrive, we're immediately going out. We're gonna finish off Yan Bai Hu. Meanwhile, let's see if Sun Tzu has it in him to surrender. Uh oh, we can't make him surrender? Oh shit. Oh, shit. Well, this is bad. Well, I guess it's another alliance it is then, because I don't want to deal with him. Got anyone who can get there faster? 22 days, really? Well, I guess that's it. See my long. Go, go get started. Jinzo Millie.
I wanted them to surrender, but, well... Looks like with things as they are... 69,000 is not... It's too much. I just have to wait a little. Shit. Seems like they didn't want to attack from Puyang anymore. What I might do is instead bypass Puyang and attack Yi from behind. Meanwhile, something weird's happening over here. Oh, you know what I think it is? The Wu Huan decides to attack them. Is returning to base, and the Jur's forces only has like thirty thousand after that. Still, this blows, man. I have all these troops, and they're all gone. I have to wait so long just to get them started again. Oh, hey, wait a minute! Puyang is sending more troops again. <laughs> You'll never forgive me. Uh, that's so adorable. Alright, Quan Yu is here. And he has a lot of strength. I fucking hate that. Oh wow, holy shit, they sent me some interesting officers. 91 strength? That's crazy. Gorgia, you want to run, run out and do this real quick for me? Just cap a couple of territories and then return back to base. I want to go to Yi, but I have a feeling that I'll probably get intercepted by Puyang, so we'll probably, at the end of the day, still have to take Puyang. What a pain in the ass. Alright, our supplies have arrived. Let's get moving. Recruit you, me, and you, Fan. Get those two people, and then we'll govern this area. <coughs> Alright, nothing left. Let's go.
I've captured an officer. We can even chop off his head if you want. I'll just put him in the freezer for now. Why don't we go with our new son, your buddy? Hmm. He's a battle general and does not suffer any ill effects from getting surrounded. How interesting. His movement is incredible too. 27? Jesus Christ, man. Alright, let's go, Sanyu, buddy. Let's go cut down that Guan Yu together. Oh, hey, if I take this, I can activate Surround and Conquer. Alright, it's time to show off the power of Yuan Shu's missiles. I haven't seen that in a long time. I've been waiting to do Surround and Conquer for a while now. Wu-Gate has 12,000! <laughs> you guys are the worst. <laughs> you guys are the worst. 12,000. Jesus Christ, man. Well, I have no complaints there. It's actually a sound plan. Yifeng, I need you to deliver this food. Deliver these troops to Luoyang. We'll keep these guys here just in case something weird happens. Ugh, we could never get that to work. Alright, let's go. Just walking in the traps all day. Once we stepped on the Baima, we should be able to launch our missiles. We just can't let Manchong catch up to us. If Manchong catch up to us, we're, we're fucked. We should probably give some backup. Let's see. Two speed, Jesus Christ. Get there in 14 days. Get your fastest troops. Get there in 
six days, seven days. I need you to provide backup, so I might have you do this. Just long enough for him to s steer away. This asshole's trying to take my dock? Are you kidding me? That's okay, it's not big deal. I'll deal with him. Target anyone you run into. <coughs> Zhang Lu should be more willing to surrender. But once he does, that'll be helpful. Yes, that's it. Let's go. Sun Tzu sends messenger. I would like to extend our alliance. He'll even pay me. Okay, if Sun Tzu wants it so bad, he can have it. Launch missiles! <laughs> Boom. Now our buddy Manchung is in serious trouble. He fell into our trap, activated our trap car. Now we need to run into him. After you defeat them, just return to base. We have Yan Liang coming, and once again with one shell. Ancient China has that stuff.
Ooh. We just learned Parthian tactics. Please say thanks. King. <clears throat> Alright, we got everything we need out of Parthia. We're done there. But what is Parthian Ooh. tactics? Let's see. Oh, that's right. It's a um, combat tactic. <coughs> Tons of damage and confuses people. I see. I wonder who to give that to. They all died. All 60,000 people died. It was insane. That's why we need to capture Guan Yu and put him in a prison and never let him out. He must have done something. Honestly, do we have someone who can keep people in prison? I need one of those right now. Because there's got to be someone who can do that. Hmm, Stone Soldier. Interesting. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did I just spot one? Is this humble man from Jiaoji capable of such techniques? Oh, no, no, that's not it. <laughs> it just makes it so that we counterattack stronger. Come on, where are those people who can keep people in prison? I need one of those right now, so then I don't have to worry about that shit ever again. Why you look fattening? You know what? I'm gonna just gonna take a quick glance at the master list and see um, who those people are. Because I have no idea who they are. I'd like to know who. <clears throat> this OST sounds like Toy Story. Uh. Actually, hold on. I got a better idea. Actually, no, wait. I can just find out here, can I? These are some of the new traits in this game. Let's see. Oh! Gam Sao. There it is. So whoever is governor of this place 
will cause prisoners to not be able to escape. I have to see who has gone so as the uh, basically prison guard as the trait. Hopefully, I can find them. There are actually people with no traits. That's just plain deplorable. Oh no! Wait, no, no. It's just okay. Never mind. You know, take a quick glance because I, I need to make sure that I uh, know who the hell they are. Gamso. Break trap. <laughs> Interesting. Sorry, this is all like very Chinese. I, I know. Just give me a second. I, 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 oh, Shen Pei has it. Oh, Shen Pei is interesting. Okay, I'll keep him in mind. So he's on Yuan Shao's team right now, so that's gonna be a problem. You know that that also explains why some of my prisoners aren't escaping because he is in command. So Shen Pei can keep people in prison. Interesting. Do I have any of those? Eh, whatever. I guess taking a look. Now that I know what it does, I just have to look at my own list of officers. <clears throat> Gam soap. Because I need a guy who can keep people in prison right now. And if I don't have them, it'll be really unfortunate. It's got to be someone I have. I have, like, pretty much half the country. There's got to be a prison guard, one or two. Oh, hey, this guy. Hey, I found one right away. Oh, sweet. Let me just keep them locked in for now. So there is one prison guard. Good, good. Good, I'm gonna have to remember this guy. Who else can do it? Capture, but you don't keep people in prison. Oh, Shang Long has it as well. Oh, okay. So, okay, I have two people who can keep people in prison. Shang Long and this guy. Stats. Oh, shit. That's not what I meant to do. Shit, I fucked it up. Now I lost him. God damn it. I just wanted to take a look at his stats, and then I lost him because I hit the wrong button. Fuck. Where the fuck did he go? He just disappeared. There they are, okay. At the bottom. Right, let's see. Seven six three. Okay, you you'll be the best one for this. And you come here quick too. Alright, from now on I'm gonna base you here so that you can keep all the prisoners that we get. 
And if you get ever get fucking Guan Yu as a prisoner, I want you to fucking keep him there. Forever. Maybe not that many, I just need you to quickly kill a guy and come back. Oh, as I thought, these assholes are back again. Just stay here, stay by the gate, and when the enemy approaches, you have to deal with them. Well, we're done with Parthia, so about near a thousand is when you get everything from them. I can't wait for some permanently locked one. I don't want to see his face ever again. <clears throat> Let's go capture him this time. Come on. Don't let him escape. Pal has reached India. Oh, and Gao Shun escaped from prison. <laughs> very good, very good. You go ahead and return. Okay, You've had enough. Huh. I sent Shahotun to attack and he just walked away. Okay, that's great. Well, might as well. Yeah, it might be better this way. <clears throat> I have to deal with Yang Yang coming now. All right, buddy boy, send me more troops. Because Lord knows I'm going to need lots and lots of troops. And also send someone to make Zhang Lu get on his knees. Because we need to um, move on with our lives now. I need more territories.
Once I take this part here and get ready to engage any enemies that may come out to attack my siege weapons. I don't know what these guys are doing, but they're doing something weird. I guess I'll let them do whatever they want. I need you to send some troops over to Tong Gate. Alright, we here, you did enough damage. Come back. <coughs> I need to send some good officers to defend this place now. Let's see. Wang Zhong and Xiao Dun. Holy shit, they've gotten strong from their little um, visits. Wang Zhong became a serious monster. Alright, you four will defend uh, Tong Gate from now on. Keep the Xilang people from doing whatever they please. That's your job. And eventually, you guys will counterattack and take Chang'an from you. But we'll stack troops over there to get ready for that. Meanwhile, the main battle line here. I'd say I'd send these two out, but they're fight is against Yan Liang. Yan Liang is actually pretty tough, so why don't we... Hmm. Ganway would have been decent, but... Ganway is not a commander. He's not very good at fighting out for a while. I guess after I deal with Guan Yu... Oh no, wait, Guan Yu's already dealt with. Uh, after I deal with uh, Wen Tao, I'll deal with Yan Liang as well. Because I'm fucking Lu Bu, I can do that. Let's mark it like this. First, I cut off the supply route. Then, I march all the way over here and attack. Boulders compete. Let's go. Oh shit, did I just walk away out of the room there? You're supposed to press the attack? God damn it! Looks like Xu Chang is about to be expanded into a large city. Now it can hold a hundred thousand troops, I think. <coughs> Problem though is that 
You know, maybe it was a good idea that I walked away before I ended up getting caught up in a fight that I don't really want to deal with. Anyway, uh, no, I can only hold 70,000, never mind. Let's see, how big is this city? This city is big. I can hold 10,000. Uh, 100. 100,000. Oh, no, 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 it's Xu Chang that expanded. Ah, I see, I see, okay. That's what happened. Some, oh, it's still medium. Home gate should be able to hold the enemy forces for now. And once I get that yeah, evil I man, see. that Wang Zhong there, Wang Zhong will shoot them to pieces because he's the master archer. Oh, shit, I gotta keep Gao Shun the rank again because he managed to lose it when he died earlier. and send about 5,000 support troops to build weird shit again. I need you to build some weird fire traps. On second thought, I'll deal with this myself. If I could duel Zhang Fei, that would be even better. Alright, let's go. Go kick his ass. Drive over there and kick his ass. Oh. Chang Fei is running away now. Here, I've got a bunch of books. Oh, go, thank you. Oh, by the way, surrender. 
What? Surrender will collapse. Oh, I think I'll surrender. Okay. Whoop. And now Zhang Lu surrenders. All right, Wong Zhong, show us your power. Oh, wait, Wong Zhong beats a right. Why does he know I'm nowhere? Let's go give him one man out. All these are filled. Shit, all the officer ranks have been filled. Hmm. I guess you're shit out of luck there, buddy. <laughs> um Oh shit. I guess you'll replace Cheng Lian for a bit, because I don't plan on using Cheng Lian anytime soon. I thought I would, but he actually isn't as good as I thought. Alright, so now, you take these archers and shoot them. Leave 3,000 troops behind. All you need to do is sit here and shoot them. And then you win! They lose. Georgia! I'd send you. Nope, now that I've captured this place, let's turn Tell this into a military stronghold. Two meatheads, that's not doing anything to come over here and help out. Meatheads, not fighters. I mean, not uh, governors or some shit. I need meatheads. Xiao Shang? Hmm, I guess he's decent. He's even got training on him. I know, I'll send some of the Sanyurs over there. The Sanyurs fight well on the hills, so they'll be perfect. <laughs> Let Han Zhong be taken care of by those guys. Also, holy shit, 89k gold? Yeah, this place will be well supplied for all kinds of stuff later. We'll build a keep here. 
All right, now we're done. Let's go watch the battle of the gate. Fucking Wang Zhong just shooting them to pieces. What would happen? What the hell happened? How did these guys end up getting the Sanyur pissed off? Are you guys fucking kidding me? Let me fix this up a little. How did you guys get them pissed off? I'm gonna make it so that you guys don't fucking do this shit anymore. You guys can't build anything anymore, because you guys clearly can't be trusted with building things. You probably accidentally ran into a Sanyir and then attacked them, and now I have to fix this problem. The fuck? I have five officers that just left my oh, forces as a result. In any case, we'll take him out. Come on. <clears throat> Meanwhile, Wei Yan will go over here and take this asshole out. Hold on. I gotta fix my relationship with the Sun Yur once you assholes fucking get out of, out of the fucking way. I don't even know if I'm going to get those officers back now. Son of a fucking bitch. All because these guys decide that they're going to wander into that territory. Ugh. Fucking Guan Yu's back again, that piece of shit. Get that Liu Bu out to deal with that piece of shit. Defenses should be easy. Let's make sure our battles here are taken care of. Sun Yu's attacking this place that I'm fixing. Oh, Sun Yu in the Oh, a Roman guy is coming. Hey, look at this guy, he's so white.
a leadership book <clears throat> of 10 that allows you to retreat. Oh, thank you. If he ends in trouble, hurry and do save him. Looks like Wang Zhong has managed to drive them out. Their siege weapons are destroyed. <clears throat> Right, because of that whole horrible situation earlier, now I have to go find another person to come. Cao Xing, you, you back. Is the power up kit worth it? Well, it's kind of fun, I guess, but it didn't. It doesn't change much about the game, just so you know. Probably need more troops before we send out another envoy, so we'll wait for now. Over. Hopefully Chao Lin would stop this foolish behavior and get back. We're supposed to be allies with them. What the fuck happened? Hold on. That much gold? Are you kidding me? Let me see how much more money do I have. Uh, I suppose I have a lot. Or maybe I can just do it small. You know what, let's just do it small. I don't want to be finding myself not gaining as much as I wish I could. I'll just send them regular uh, visits. Wait, 
can't attack. I even said you can't attack. Why are you sending troops out to attack? Tolerance controls 90k troops. Oh wow, we are still at 300k though. That's some serious business. I need to start separating uh, my my supplies in a more cleaner manner. Yes, that's Wang Yun just now. Earlier. Capture Guan Yu. Do not let him escape. some cool things let's see oh it allows us to develop lands harder how wonderful I hope he gets captured, but he hasn't gotten captured yet. He's a piece of shit. Look at that fucking Shao Dun has visited so many times. His stats are like this. That's what happens when you travel. You, you get stats like this. Hell, Fa Ching has 98 int from all this, too. Jesus Christ, man. I'll send Zhang Liao out as well. Fuck it. Let's turn Zhang Liao into a horrible monster as well. Since Rome is cool and all that, we will give them uh, some cool stuff too. Here, look. We'll give the, uh, the Romans this awesome book. That cure that's said to cure any sickness. You know what? We need to give them a more appropriate number. 69 420. How's that? That's a lot, right? That's good. Beautiful number. We will send them. 22269. There you go. Give them appropriate numbers so that they become our friends permanently. place will start raising its own troops. What's up? Okay. 
I should really ask for a subjugation squad. Building this keep, no matter what. Give me me. What's up? I understand. can return for now. And afterwards, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start capping these lands and build random shit and we're gonna gradually press Puyang into a place where they can't support themselves and then hopefully I can take it over because there's their stats are way too high right now I don't want to deal with that shit meanwhile I'm gonna go and keep sending money to Sun Yir hopefully they'll, they'll, they'll like this shit and they'll send those officers I believe they'll take this castle soon, so maybe I should just join in. Oh. <coughs> Once I gain enough troops, I'll put them on Tong Gate and have them take over Chang'an from there. Then we'll make a first step towards seizing this land as well. Hopefully, sometime this year, we will capture Guan for today. Oh, really? Pachang wants to play with me? With me? With me? Fei let himself into a trap. He got himself trapped. That's his own fault. Now we're gonna take his ass out. Control! Zhang Fei! Don't think you can escape. <laughs> I like how these characters know each other and will bark threats at each other. That's very adorable. Kind of cute.
I need you to ship some food over here. Toba. Meanwhile, we in. Wipe them out, and then head inside the base. We'll probably have to drag some people over to govern this place as well, so let's hop to it. People who have nothing better to do, and not in... start separating these provinces a little bit so that Chaorin doesn't end up ha handling too many places at once. I know. Still need to go to um, India again. Apparently, the Indians have some uh, Ashura fighting style. That sounds really, really badass. So we're gonna pay them a visit. stuff to India and call it a day. I don't know what's blinking down there, but I think the game is about to break. So we have Zhang Fei surrounded. Hopefully we capture him. That would help a lot. We'll put him in prison for life.
Oh yeah. Chang'an is a horrible place. What kind of asshole is spreading fucking rumors like this? Jian Yi will be an interesting fight. Oh, but wait a minute, I can just cap this. Ah, and then I will launch missiles and I'll take over this place. Very good. And once I'm done, I can finally move my best officers elsewhere. Up north. Okay, so we finished building that keep after defeating Zhang Fei. Let's head back, mm. regroup, and then we plan our next move. I'm thinking about capping territories, so we'll do that in a little bit. Take Chang'an soon, what a pain in the ass. Meanwhile, someone is making the Shen Bi hate me. But see, the problem with the Shen Bi is like really far away, so there's really no point in that. Oh. Oh.
好吧。Yeah, I play a lot of the、um, old romance of Three Kingdoms as well. The first one in particular, I played a lot of. The music is absolutely horrendous, but that's okay. It's because it was an old game. All right, come on, get that supplies transport over here. Keep buttering up the sunier after that stupid accident. Don't get wobble. And I have no more money. Shit. Well, hopefully these guys will grab that 22k and bring it in there. The Zhang Liao and pals are doing well in Rome. What they say. Gao Shun, you will take care of this area. This is a simple search and destroy mission. You kill everyone you meet, and then. Scout around the area. We won't be actually attacking anyone yet.、And、then again, maybe I shouldn't send Gao Shun. Galshun is nice. I like him, but I need him to、uh, do some emergency capping in case that's a necessity. And the same thing goes with Simai as well. I believe Liu Bu can handle this on his own. Simai speed twenty two. Twenty two with fish formation. Actually, pretty impressive. But he can reach a speed up to forty two. Hmm. If we're capping land, we probably don't need to be. Hmm. Yeah, a second, maybe I should change the orders a bit. 
Let's see. Yeah, Gorjak can travel fast, but he only travels at 39. What the fuck is CMI on? What kind of drugs is he on? Why is he so fast? 42? Even faster than Guoja. Alright, so here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna do this. Travel to Tao Chen's area and get ready to start fucking them up. As a matter of fact, I'll tell your objective here is to intercept this guy. The Gaoshun, you will stand by with 12,000 people and get ready to run this fucking ram into their city. Which was a supply coming. Almost there. 32k, we should be able to take Jan Yi, considering our opponent. But our opponent is on a hill, and that is kind of troublesome to deal with. <coughs> I mean, 14 is based on- oh shit, what the, what the, what the fuck? See, my is just charging right into Guan Yu, that's not good. Son of a bitch. Well, there goes his adventures. I didn't expect Guan Yu to just fucking appear out of nowhere. Alright, next target is Guan Yu then, because fuck that asshole. You see, Mai was running so fast, he just ran right into him, and now he's dead. I hope he's okay. Now that our supplies have reached this place, let's begin our next phase of invasions. Gunning and pals. I think Wei Yan should have more troops. Considering the importance of Wei Yan's mission, 
He should have more troops. We build a keep. How do I understand this game? Because I'm Chinese. That's how I understand this game. It is a pretty uh, intense looking game. Though. Not gonna lie, it does look like a lot of work. And it is. That guy with the big tits who came visiting us so often. See if we can't cut off your supply. Take your base. And then resituate ourselves here. <laughs> and Tao Tao, on the other hand, will do things a little differently. But ultimately, we will still end up around the same spot. Hmm. All right, see Maya, you back for more? Let's do it. Looks like even Tao Jian himself is coming. He's sending troops out now, too. That's kind of adorable. Next season, we'll start transporting more stuff around. For now, <laughs> Roman. <laughs> Holy shit, there's that Simaiya already. Took no time at all for him to get there. Oh, 
Well, let's build some more weird shit on the map. <clears throat> Yeah, Tal Chen is coming out here in force. So, maybe we'll actually be able to do something for once. What you done? Hopefully we can take that before Tao Chen gets here, because Tao Chen apparently has eyes on Jian Yi as well. You know, and we would rather take it ourselves. You know what I mean? It's better if it's mine than if it's theirs. Also, there's a lot of fucking money here, so I'm gonna go and uh, move some of it over to. That's a lot of fucking money. A lot of fucking food, too. Ship it over here to the capital, please. At some point, I probably should make Luoyang my capital. But for the time being, I'm still working at Tanmo. And Chang'an still has the Emperor. Oh, man. Oh, right, it's a new season. Okay, why don't we do this? Move this shit over. Put it in the gate. Don't shimba! From over here. I think I'll leave these two areas still because there might be uh, trouble down the line, and I don't want to be caught with my pants down because I uh, allocated all my troops to the north. It would be kind of annoying. I mean, I still have 300k troops, so that's good enough.
子命令。动身吧！非常感谢你。哇哦！ Really ballsy enough to transport that right past them? Jesus, dude! I feel that's an incredibly dangerous move, and also stupid. So I'm gonna help them out by sending troops here and get ready to escort them. I'm ready. That is the same deal here as well. Well, actually, hold on. Gates can hold fifty thousand troops. I'm sending. Hmm, hmm, okay, that's good enough. Trova. Hopefully they don't do anything, and I just cross over these mountains safely to deliver my goods. If they do something, then I will get mad, and then I will kill them. Why is your empire pink? <laughs> 请交给我吧。我在这儿。嗯。I think thirteen's better. Just because I like the RPG more. Fire the missiles. 请您过目。And then there's Simai over here now. Damn, he's fast. All right, that is why we prepared siege weapons ahead of time, so that. The time comes. We can take it out. Let's go. Follow my orders. Hopefully, this time with our allies, we can actually take this place now. Because I'm really tired of this place. This place has been a thorn. A thorn by my side for too long. Now we're gonna build some catapults in the area. Oh, what? Why hold back on the troop count? Bring them all.
即刻出征。吕布问曹操 ，You will build a catapult. You will start launching shitty rocks at them. 嗯嗯嗯嗯。Mm. Something horrible is happening over here. I really hope I reach it before they do. I get to launch the nukes and take this area. Mm. Oh, I still have enough food over here. We'll take this area and then attack them from behind. Take down Yan Liang and oh no, that's Wen Chou. <laughs> and take these guys down. We stand a good chance at getting rid of them. And finally, I would actually make some progress in this fucking game. It's been ten thousand years now. I need progress. I can't just fuck around like this any longer. Progress, I need it. I've been stuck, bogged down by Pu Yang for too long. I took his stuff. <laughs> he dares appear before me on a boat. I take your stuff. Alright, we reach India now. We are coming back. <laughs> Fucking Yushu just jumped into the water to attack Chen Lin. What an asshole! Just jumps right into the water. Fucks him up. Up, oh, the supply troops are almost there. I suppose I can send some colonizers. Let's see who's not busy doing anything. You're not doing anything. You're not doing anything. Wow, why are you not doing anything? You're supposed to be a recruiter. Or trainer. For some reason you're wounded. But you'll come and colonize as well. Unstrin? Eh, we can forget about this guy. I know you're not doing anything. Five guys isn't enough. Not five guys, burgers and fries. I need more, more guys.
Nine guy burgers and fries. There we go. That is how you govern a place. You get nine guys over to do it. We have Puyang completely surrounded. So now, here's what we'll do. We'll, mm, and then, we will hide somewhere over there. Back in safety. And when we find an opportunity again, we launch Simai again. Oh wow, Manchong is here? What the fuck? Chao Xiu led lead a small force to protect the siege weapons. Cao Hong and Cao Chun is too busy doing the recruitment to do anything. Guo Jia, I need you to do this. So this asshole wants to fuck with us. Is it? Go cut off his supply route real quick. And then return to base. Now we'll capture some land over here. Well, by man and other places we can leave for the time being. Right. Because they have a lot of land. I gotta stop sending all my officers out to um, those horrible places. It's taking them forever to come back. And what are these guys doing? They're traveling away. Are they traveling away from Chang'an to invade me? If that's the case, that's the worst mistake they can ever make. Regardless, I believe we are ready to launch some nukes and wrap this campaign up over here. Alright, let's see what the situation here in the north is then. So this is Rome! Look at these guys just traveling in Rome. Look how happy they are. Zhang Liao and pals have finished visiting Rome and now they're coming back. Xiao Hu Dun's ability just increased. Zhang Fei is dueling Cao Cao, that's not even fair. And it's not like the last time when it was 75 versus 75, this is 79 versus 99. <laughs> Yes. 
He would have done well if he had more war. That's fucked up. Here's another nuke. Gather energy. Fire the nukes. More enemy reinforcements en route. Seems like the enemy is otherwise occupied. Let's go and snatch this land real quick. And travel back across the meeting. All right, now that the nukes has been launched, let's go and take over this city. Okay, Woba. Come on. Oh, they managed to take that territory though before I launched the nuke, fucking asshole. Meanwhile. Well, let's go get ready. We're moving into Jianyi now. We're sending everything we've got. Xu <laughs> Chang now has more troops. Send their asses over. Well, actually, no. Wait till next season. And Tong Gei is about to get more troops soon we'll be able to descend upon Chang'an and these guys I don't know what the fuck they're doing is too far away to support it so I will definitely take Chang'an today mm. Mm. <laughs> you thought you could defeat I Lu Bu? I fucked them both up in an instant. I'm gonna snatch this and then I'm gonna stop Yuan Shao. In fact, I'll just sit there. Actually, no, wait. Come on. Take this. And travel here. And stay here. Bye, Ma. What's that? Jing Xi Yi Chi. Sure. Don't let him escape. Jesus Christ, stop him. And once we have this place isolated, we will launch all of our siege weapons to take Puyang. Because I'm tired of this place. It must disappear. Oh, 
you know what, I'll give it one more turn to go even deeper into the valley. Once they get even deeper in the valley, they're not gonna come back in time. They will not make it in time. And then I will fuck them up. I will take their city from behind, they'll run out of food, and then they will Face DIE! Mmm! You die! Okay, Well, now, around the next turn, we can probably go in. I, I think we're, we will be okay. 7200 that should be good right mm. Mm. oh looks like Liu Bei is coming this way Here's another. Whee! Okay, yeah, this place is definitely finished. <laughs> I, I, I've been launching nukes nonstop, and that's it. Good, he found the bug. Hmm. Yeah, that fucking Liu Bei on his fucking boat again. We remember what happened last time. Oh yes. Right, you're free to return to base. You're also free to return to base. Great work capturing all these territories. Now, I just need to prevent enemy reinforcements from sure. coming in. Sure. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to walk over here and create a catapult. And if Liu Bei wants to stop me, he, he can. I will just hit him in the, in the head. Meanwhile, the rest of our forces are ready to make a deep... Direct assault into the enemy forces. No sure, ma. Siege weapons are ready to go. Let's do it. Oh. Mm, made it back. But he's a little wounded, so we'll give him a little time to rest, because he's fucked up. Fucked up bad! We will send our local prisoner management guy to... You know what? I should give him a rank. There's hardly any ranks I can give him. That's terrible. Mm. 
thousand, six thousand. That's all you're gonna get. Sorry, Val. But get over there quick and deal with this. Hmm. Sure. Now it's gonna be pretty incredible yeah, if we fuck this one up too. I'm gonna be very upset. Meanwhile, our buddies have made it over here to start sieging. Oh, shit. All Chan's pieces of shit are here as well. We better take this castle. Because, I mean, after all this work, it should be our castle. Smiling monster chasing people down. But if I don't go into the water, it'll be okay. Yep, they are indeed going deeper and deeper into the valley. Okay, well, since you want to play like that, I mean, that is why I set all this stuff up. Oh no, I feel like though I'm missing some kind of officers there. I think I know why too. They uh they probably got sent on that stupid mission again and I forgot. No, oh, it's okay, it's not a big deal. Because we will now display the power of which we capture land. Building all. Oh, oh no, 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 I'm going to the water. Oh my god, dude, he's fucking me up. Maybe I should have not bothered him. Because he actually hits harder than me in the water. What the fuck? Ah, maybe I shouldn't have tried, tried doing that. Oh, it's okay. I'll just pull back for now. Holy shit, he had a lot of troops, but now most of them are dead because of this asshole. I should go fight Zhu Hong right now. It would be inappropriate if I... If my siege goes poorly because of this. Let's go way in. We gotta take his ass out. Right, let's see how this battle goes.
Oh, yep, I'm stuck in the water. <laughs> Shit. Did I take it? You're not going to be, you're going to the fridge for now. Oh, the Indian sent me another messenger. Let's see. Crane formations movement, siege, and... Oh, destroy obstacles. Very nice. Now I can actually put crane formation to use. And... I have this place under siege. Now. Finally, sure. my units came in contact with Fu Young. It's been such a long time since I finally had a chance to do it. Truly am stuck in the water. This is bad. Well, at least I took care of them. Now I can go inside. Long list of people that can join. Dai Bu Lian Shi Ling Chao Ling Chao means I can get his son Ling Tong at some point. Bu Ji. Yeah, give him the palm. If you give him the palm, he'll certainly join. No problem. You know what, instead of doing going through this list, what I'm gonna do is just um oh, you know, uh, Wei Yan has one last mission to do. <clears throat> Wei Yan needs to take over the, these territories. Yes, now I can turn this area over to the AI in a bit. How wonderful! Conquered Yan Province. Doo -doo. Tells me how important naval combat is in this province. Conquered Wu Yu. That's a big chunk of territory I just took. <laughs> Do -do! <laughs> Holy shit, that's a lot of EXP.
And the last gift I'll get from the Indians is the, um, <coughs> is the elephant charge technique. Since gunning you, you're done. You can go. Zhang Shun, since you aren't doing anything, go on this trip. I want Elephant Charge. I don't know who is going to get Elephant Charge, but whoever's getting it is going to wreck the living shit out of everything in the universe. And I don't even know how that's possible, but that's possible. I stuck in the water. Oh wait, no, I'm not stuck in the water. I'm on land now. Okay, you're stuck in the fucking water. Okay, you're getting fucked. If you're still chasing after me anyway, you piece of shit. Tongsimba! Meanwhile, let's go recruit Yan Baihu and uh, Yan Qing. Might as well. Because I am kind, very kind man. Well, if you're gonna travel that far, whatever then. I don't think you have anything better to do. Alright, I think this is good enough. Now, let's see, what else can we do here? We're already level 5 with everything. We could get level 5 arrow, or level 5 crane. Hmm. What about in terms of personnel? Oh hey! That'll get us to level 6. Hmm. 6 isn't good enough though. Unfortunate, because I want bigger ships. I want big boats. I don't want little boats. I want big boats. Five. Increase the number of troops that we get from recruiting. Level nine. Increase the number of our gains from investment. 
I think I'll take that route. <clears throat> now, as for war... Archers, crane, fish. I think fish is like one of the most reliable formation. Or increase the strength of our siege weapons. That's always reliable, right? Mmm. 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 Oh, we just upgraded our crane formation. Maybe I'll look into look into that. Then again, I don't know how how many people are actually useful with crane. Fish is a very reliable formation. But you know, I've never tried crane before. You know what? I like Tawin, so... Oh, shit! We don't have enough books! Never mind all that. I have to wait for next turn to do that. <clears throat> now, let's take this place, for fuck's sake. Good. Oh, yes. Oh, for fuck's sake. Thank God Puyang actually cannot defend itself. Like... Oh, I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased to see the end of this shit. Well, oh, and Chang'an is suffering a similar problem. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Lose your castle. Get locked up. All right, good. Now, with this, you've gained the geographical location uh, advantage of gaining extra 150% for when you do po politics with other people. Isn't that great? No, oh, I captured his son. Oh, I captured Sinpi. <laughs> Sin <coughs> Sinpi, that stubborn bastard, he'll never surrender. You want to ally now? I mean, I was just thinking about making use of him. No, I'm actually on land. I'm okay. I'm on land. I'm kicking his ass. Oh, yeah. Thank fuck. Let's go inside this place now. Also, let's go and convince our pal Hong Rong. What is this? What's this? Why don't they surrender? That's not natural. We count as not next door to each other? Oh, if that's the case, then we have a problem. Then I should have accepted their alliance offer, because then that would have been cheap. And I guess we're not next door to each other. I, I can't convince them to surrender. I have to take this place. Ping Yuan, you know how to do that. But, conquered 
and province. How much money is in this place? Oh, not bad. Right, first things first, we're going to recruit some people. Yeah, looks like these dumb fuckers just now noticed what we're doing. Might be a little late for that though, because I think Chang'an is mine now. Anyway, we have troops here at Puyang and Xuchang ready to go. Just gonna wait for Wei Yan to take these places. <coughs> For the time being, start recruiting here. And the Tao Chen, that fucker, took like two lands while they're here. Alright, before I go and continue, let me just take a piss and then I will continue. Right. Now let's do a couple more things, and then we will stop soon. For now we will watch the continued battle of Liu Bu versus Liu Bei in the water. Oh, I shot him. Oh, I think he's done. He's running away. Continue to serve the Han, okay? Yeah. 
I decide to go and take the Emperor for now. And we will become Rat Emperor later. <clears throat> I need the Imperial Seal after all. Without it, I can't unleash my true power. In any case, let me get someone to uh, support <coughs> over there now. Hmm. Alright, you five will start supporting our troops in Chang'an from now on. Taken over Tong Gate. Let's move all that shit over too. I'm gonna play Total War as well at some point, but for now, I want to beat this. I wonder why he didn't ally. Let me go this. Since currently my um, di diplomatic power is multiplied. I can just do this and it should be okay. <coughs> All right, now let's see. We should start capping Ping Yuan. P, I think. I'd like to take Yi, but uh, we should go here. After all, this is where every everywhere borders. I originally did crane, but hardly anyone uses crane. 
I think I'm gonna go with fish again. Fish or arrow at some point. Oh, we could probably go with four fish. Yeah, let's go with four fish. That's a lot more um, stable. Or, instead of sending Kaohsiung in, we could wait and send him as um, battering ram later. Yes, yes. Let me do that. Right now, the first thing we're going to do is build a camp in this area. Now I used official formation. <coughs> Zhang Liao provided. Fish, fish, fish. Can't wait for Wei Yan to get done so that I can send him to other missions. Oh, how did how did Zhou Tai ever ended up in in our uh, prison? How did this happen? I think it was Zotai who got his ass kicked and then went to prison. <laughs> Their prison. For some reason, I couldn't recruit him. Alright, now Chao Pi has joined me. How cute.
Oh, the Sanyur officers are back now. Now that <laughs> we're friends with them again. Isn't that cute? Looks like there's some officers in Chang'an that needs to be looked at. Xu Chang now has 35k troops. I can't even carry all of it over. Fuck. I just realized we don't have enough food over there, so let's transport some now. I'll do it! I! You want shoe? Go transport the food! Because I've got nothing better to do, so I transport the food. Dongshenba! Isn't it great? It's so touching. The Lord transport food. Like Wei Yan has finished his mission and he's coming back now. Good. Once he returns to base, I'm gonna send him off elsewhere. And he could perform his duties in Chang'an or something. Take over Xiliang with these guys. Han Zhong already has 42k troops, Jesus. These guys don't fuck around when it comes to troop counts. You know what? I find this in highly inspiring, so I'm gonna tell these guys to do it too. I say this, but could they actually last the trip? Probably not, so we're gonna put them over in Wan first. Then from Wan, we'll move over to Chang'an. theater of operation could probably be concentrated here now. <coughs> Since the bottom right corner of the map has been suppressed. See, Jian is good. Du Ji, though, is the best one. Oh, don't Simba! Easy. Meng Da is pretty decent. Or I should pick him up anyway, for fun. <laughs> Ooh, 
We shouldn't let him get away. I say this, but we don't have the officers necessary at the moment. They're all busy doing something. So he's gonna get away. That's a shame. Oh well. Is there any other strong officers who can help me with this? I see Cao Ren, huh? Could be useful. All right, drag those meatheads over. Ah. Mario uses their fucking missiles himself? What the fuck? Since when does Mario have nuclear missiles? Fucking Mario doing this shit to me. Luckily for me, the damage isn't too extensive. Now, we should plan on getting rid of him. His troop count is still 35k, though. And the alliance... Yuan Shao's alliance still lasts for 10 months. Looks like I should probably extend my alliance with um, Liu Yan before something gets out of hand. Fucker Mario is trying to escape. You want to chase after him and rip him to shreds? <coughs> I 
Mm, might as well use that as an opportunity to weaken their troop strength a little. And get inside, huh? I'll take Uji with. <coughs> we are going to be capturing a lot of land after all. These guys. You have sixty three officers. Let's see. Sixty officers, sixty three, seven cities. I distribute my land pretty evenly. This is for myself. Oh, the Roman man is coming. Let's see what he has to give me. Roman Legion. The Roman Legion is very powerful. This allows us to adapt that technique. And we can unleash our personal skills more often. Also, beep beep! Who, who is bystander? They never do anything. <laughs> who is bystander?
Now we go back to that horrible place again. <coughs> Zhang Liao, after all his practices, as you can see, has risen his stats to this. <clears throat> Xia Houdun has risen his stats to this from all that traveling. That's deplorable. That's absolutely deplorable. Hell, Mengda, you don't seem like you're doing anything. You can go with them. <laughs> I'm gonna keep Zhang Liao around now because I need him for the uh, coming campaign. Xia Houdun, though, you can keep going. I'd like to see what kind of stats you're gonna get at the end of all this. Oh hey, we got a vase. I don't know where we got this, but we we'll give that to them as a gift. This place is well raised. Oh, looks like Mario is escaping. He's fast too. Let's see though if we can catch up to him. Shit, I forgot to give these guys command. Oh well, they'll just wait here for now. What happened? How the hell did they cut our supplies all of a sudden? serious trouble if we don't do something about it, so let's get going. OP, take this and cut right through and provide food.
<coughs> you said Jesus did this? Oh, I knew Jesus can't be trusted. This does sound like something Jesus would do, yes. I don't think I'm gonna catch up to Mario. He's getting away. It's okay though. I'll figure out something else. see we have to go all the way around that's way too much work so in order to supply our bases you need to send someone who's not doing anything to go cut it cut a path once done we can actually start sending supply carts over <clears throat> I'm now Duke, Duke Yuan Shu. <laughs> Isn't it cute, the type of people who is congratulating the rat himself? It looks like all my officers have became rats. We have some seriously good ranks.
And now it's time for Tao Tao's forces to come skulking around on this side of the shore. Now, you know what I think it is? The harbor is the one creating this area. I should probably capture the harbor. Let's go do that real quick. The harbor is the, the thing that was fucking me up. Fucking harbor. How could a fucking near harbor do this shit to me? Simba. Probably start moving that shit now. Let's go. Chupa. Oh wow, that's a lot of troops I just took away. But that should be okay, because it's gonna be important anyway. I wonder if these guys have enough officers. Ninety-four, sixty, fifty-four. Yeah, I guess I'll ship them some once I'm done here. <clears throat> Kongrong wants to ally. Well, I'll accept it. 
It's literally free money after all. I'm gonna build this um, music tower. Once I built this music tower, I will okay, gain more. Well, What's that? For now, you guys stay put here. Okay. Mm. Okay. Great, ship all that ship over. And... I hope that shit stays in his territory. Are you winning, son? <laughs> Alright, now let's go send those guys over to the other side by building this. This area seems to be under control. Good. Prisoners that I can recruit. Now, some of them are already rotting in stats. Let's see if we can pick them up. Tima, fuck you, won't join. That's okay. Yeah, as I thought, Shin Pi would never, would never surrender. That guy, he's got will of steel. Looks like the trip to Rome is doing good. Alright, now 
those three officers are back again. How wonderful. Looks like the trip to India is also done as well. I think I might teach Sha Houdun how to use elephant charge for fun. Because I mean he went all this way all this time. I think he deserves something for his trouble. All this traveling, he's gotta learn some secret technique, right? Listen to this music for a bit while we capture this dock. Once we capture the dock, then we can do whatever the fuck we want. Oh, what's this? Fourteen five hundred home. Man, that's that's way too much for me. Never mind that. I'm hitting back these. Holy shit, your stats surpasses me quite a bit. I can't deal with you right now. I'll head right back to base. This is fine. Once I get my troops, then I will come back and kick your ass. But until then, I am unfortunately got my hands tied. Tongshenba. Talking shit about me. That's okay. I can fix this easily. take care of. Looks like my morale is about to be recovered from all this. Let's see who's in Ping Yuan. Zhang Fei's forces. Interesting. Sure. Alright, now let's start building all kinds of weird shit on the other shore. Soon Zan has been playing with these Wu Guans all this time. Got literally nothing better to do right now.
什么事？好的，有什么事吗？我们先 send this guy to the capital of this land. While he's at it, since he's here. Meanwhile, supply troopers can come in closer. That shit right now. Capture that doc. Oh, I capture that. I can cause a uh, <coughs> nuclear launch. I can actually do that safely, though. Sure. Oh, I've got balls. I'll, I'll try. Jesus, I, I just noticed like our development rate is so much higher than it used to be. It's fucking insane. Trading with India really helped out. Some weird shit going on. Oh, you know what? I just realized something. Shin B may not be my friends on this. In order to be. Oh, wow. Holy shit. Zhang Yang is 50k here? Jesus Christ, man. Shin B not being my friends to mean they could attack me from that side. Sure. 
明白了。They're sending something out now. Yan Wei will protect me. Zhang Fei, don't stand before me. <laughs> That's right, Zhang Fei. Get fucked. You made a mistake. And there's catapults throwing shit at your face. I like the way they talk smack to each other. Oh my god, that fucking castle is killing me. I hope my next move I can actually escape from the castle's range. Well, given that I just beat the little so shit out of Zhang Fei, I should probably use this opportunity sure, to go and uh, attack him now. Good, the path has been opened. Now let's go send that shit in. 38700 is a big city that can contain all those soldiers that we can get moving. Now ask for Wei Yan's help, with Chang'an. Hmm, the Sun Yur has sent me some seriously powerful men. I think I will use them. Sun Yur, Battle Lord. That would be kind of interesting to see how they perform. <coughs> After all, they're not called battle lords for nothing. Boom! Duels, Zhang Fei. Wu Ming Shu Bei, Tian 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 Fan Da Ye. 我就是天下无双的张飞。别说你张飞，我只是个最强之人。呜 ，He's gonna fly now. The truth. Go to Fala Lopoko. You draw, Mama. 
seems like this may still be too close. Let's move over here. Alright, now we need to wait for our siege weapons to get ready to attack, and then we will join them. Oh god, they're all coming here. This is bad. We've got Dongbai's forces coming as well. Alright, I suppose this is gonna be after, after we, what we do. We're gonna have to come out and sweep the enemy field. Oh, Wei Yan gets here soon. I mean, we need his help. Mm. Once Wei Yan arrives, we will lead our troops to fight off these armies coming. There's Dongbai's forces, Zhang Sao and Wu Chai are coming, and there's Fan Chou in the center, and then to the right, there's Shen Bi's. <laughs> what an interesting situation. Since we're here, let's go build some catapults. Or better yet, let's build some fire traps. Because that's what we have fire traps for. Let's build them over here. We'll set up a base around mm. these parts for the time being. Make a mess out of this area. Xu Chang apparently can produce someone. Let's see what it is. Zoba. Finally, let's send out the Battle Lord to come help us. Let's see. And get some crazy stats. Alright, let's go. Send in the Sun Yur Battle Lord to help us on this situation. Coming in. 20k troops. Tricks I've got. That's bolt. Not that I need bolts anymore. Now that I have passed through that area. Thank you. 
I've actually got nothing I need, so I mean, now I will hold off on it. Mmm, Gandhi grew quite a bit from that trip. I can give him. Ah, I know. I'll give him the God Blade. Surely, once the Indians receive this, they will give us the secrets to their elephant charges. Watch it. Zhang Liao is in serious trouble. Mm. I guess you'll have to go and build these things. Hopefully the Battle Lord and all that fun stuff can help Zhang Liao, because Zhang Liao's in serious trouble. <clears throat> so our mission here is to search and destroy, sweep everyone. See a guy you don't like, sweep him away. I'm more concerned with if Zhang Liao could escape from this particular problem. Oh. Ching Ning Guo Mu. 
Man, look at that fucking stats. 2,700 attack? This, this... This some bullshit cheating shit that they have doing down here. You told him, huh? Hey, pull back. We're gonna use the traps. What's that job? It's traps. That's why I prepared those things. Because I knew this kind of gay shit would happen. That the enemy would have cheating stats. In case anything happens, get in the way. We can't let them just suddenly send troops out to attack my uh, siege weapons. Very strong. Don't go on, I. Not just who for. Battles can be such a mess. This is probably more fun to look, look at, so let's do this. What? They're running away! Shit, they run away fast. Jesus Christ. What did he even come here for? Shin B's hiding place. That's adorable. how they're just sitting over there now with their broken stats and everything but that's okay they can, they can do whatever the fuck they want i am not gonna fight them like that but now instead i'm gonna build a catapult see oh, 
交给我吧。是吗 ？Take 平原。Let's go and sweep these territories. These guys aren't receiving energy from those places. They'll still die. Okay, we just need to take the, their energy away from them. Zhang Fei is still trapped in there. <laughs> That's cute. Chang is raising troops now. Damn it, they run very, very fast. Alright, so instead of fighting them any longer, once they escape, we will go ahead and cap some land. Oh, we'll even build some fire traps and then that's what I like to do, but I guess we can only do it in our territory. Right, I'll build a camp here then. Build all kinds of weird crap and defeat them that way through attrition, because we've learned much from uh, this game. Now. These enemies have such cheating stats that we need to use such techniques to stop them. <laughs> I like how Zhang Fei's like, oh, uh, there's a bit of an emergency here. Of course, I'm, I'm dying very fast. But, they did fell into the trap. I'm just kind of dying hard. <clears throat> They're probably sending the, the battle lord to help me out with this uh, awkward situation. Joker, 
明白了。Hey, that's a supply troop. What is it? Attack the enemy supply troops. I know. What's up? After that place, time to do some island hopping and get over there. Killed everyone here. Meanwhile, Dongbai and Pals have returned to base. What's it? Well, since our troops are out here already. Let's well do this. Build the camp, set up a whole bunch of fire traps, yada yada yada, and then prepare for tomorrow because I'm about done. I'm just like doing some island hopping here. It's pretty deplorable. You guys just replace the people who just left and build a base there for a moment. <clears throat> Shahutun has arrived at Rome once more. Oh shit, we're in trouble now. Oh 
各地发来了报告，有什么事吗？<laughs> We're going to be in serious trouble if Liu Bei seals, seals us off from our supplies, so uh, let's hurry and uh, fix that. But to prevent that from happening, I will have Sima Yi hurry and go and connect this land together now. Okay, I can launch nukes. Let's see who's got the speed necessary for this. Well, Jazz speed is 39. Gunning, what's your speed? 33. Okay, I'm having Gorja do it. All right, Gorja, I need you to step on this and cause a nuke to occur. That's all you need to do. Shoot him. <clears throat> he still has 20k troops. Now we continue to weaken them. Oh, did I kill all the supply troops? Oh, good. Oh, good. Sure, now let's go back to capping land again. The more land we cap, the better we get. Sure. Hello, W J, W R J. Holy shit, look at the way he runs. He fucking Liu Bei runs like crazy. There's no way we can catch up to him. <clears throat> well, it counts now because we've connected it. Looks like Liu Yu is planning on sending some weird shit over. <clears throat> if these stupid shit gets here, we could be in trouble.
，感激不尽。什么事吗？静息一切。有什么事吗？Hmm, I guess I'll figure that out tomorrow. I was thinking about giving some kind of treasure to um, one of my officers because I've been stockpiling treasures and I haven't figured out when to give, them, when and where to give them. In any case, I'll take this. And start building more weird crap around this area. <clears throat> After all, this is an important mission. We have to have more weird crap. Not enough weird crap, and we'll be in trouble. Send my troops to stand by and get ready to attack them. This is great. Soon I'm going to get rid of that evil, evil Yuan Shao once and for all. Fight. 
Kula. The age of Yuan Shao is ending. Once Guo Zhao makes it over, it launches nukes. Wow, how did I guess that? How long have I played this shit? I should probably stop soon. Oh, what happened? I was gonna send a nuke when I stepped on that, but now the nuke is gone. Meanwhile, weird shit is coming this way. I've got a way to stop weird shit. Use this technique. Liu Yu and Gong Sun Zhan. Gong Sun Zhan is getting stronger. If it continues, he's gonna fuck me up. And by that time, it'll be too late. Let's go and attack Gong Sun Zhan to get rid of him now. Yep. Oh no, shit! Master Liu, you, uh, there are people here that are actually friends with Gong Sun Zhan. They fucked us up. What you say? Ooh, now they know where we're going. They're gonna fuck us up. Oh, fucking bastard, that Gong Sun Zhan. How dare you do this? He's even using the fucking civilians as a human shield. Those fucking bastards. Only that kind of piece of shit would do this. That Gong Sun Zhan. We captured him. It's like, I'll let you live. I'm such a nice guy. Force him to try to summon rain, but no matter how long, rain didn't come down, and so he was executed anyway as an as an evil person who tries to be the emperor. Yep. And now you know that stupid shit that was coming this way. They're gone now. Uh, what stupid shit? There's no stupid shit here. Instantly disappeared. All because of a stupid event. Now that is what stupid shit is all about. Yu Yu has died. And that's what he gets yeah. for sending stupid shit at me. I merely just activate an event. And I send him straight to the Shadow Realm. Troops ready and get ready to fuck him up. Uh. Here, you, you build some fire traps too. Tao Tao shouldn't be the only one building fire traps. We need more fire traps. Okay, Building a camp here now, good. So my expansion to the left has also begun. And let's see, how long is Yuan Shao continues to be... Uh, four more months. Our alliance with these guys still lasts for a while. I have 400k troops. 400k. So hopefully one of these days these guys will realize the error of their ways, get on their knees, and become my sex.
He's the pink land. Yes, I'm the pink land. <clears throat> I'll take that land right back. <laughs> now I'm gonna go right back and build things over there again. To me. You. Use this opportunity to build stupid traps. And also stupid catapult towers. And I can probably send in more reinforcements soon now that I have gotten them inside. I'll let them train a bit, and then I will have them come out and build more stupid shit. But we need stupid shit right now. Leading 15k troops coming this way <coughs> with almost 3,000 attack. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I'm changing my plans. I'm building the fire over here. Right next to our base. You come to our base, you can get welcome with a giant explosion. Look how happy Boon Soon's arm is after that mess has happened. Of course, now he's doing the same shit to me. He's sending weird shit to me now. That's gonna be a problem. Uh, it's actually a lot of weird shit coming. You know, it'd be kind of nice if I have a boat. Alright, so here's the situation. There's a lot of weird shit coming. So... I need to defeat Yuan Xiao over there as quickly as possible, then go to Ping Yuan to cover it. And if I can get rid of Yuan Xiao, actually, I mean, that, that would be even better, then these guys won't be under some shitty alliance anymore. Yeah. <laughs> In any case, we're ready to begin our expedition into taking over Yi now. To me. Sure. And, while this is going on, I'm going to build more stupid shit. Over.
请您过目。Oh man, they all got in their fucking boats. They're coming to give me weird shit. Mm. Well, with the current situation as it is, we have no choice but to just put up with it now. We're about to reach a nuclear launch point. And once we reach the nuclear launch point, we should be able to weaken the enemy enough that our current standing troops are enough. I have to then hurry back and see if we can't protect Ping Yuan from the evil forces of Kung Sun Zan. Oh man, we have to wrap this up really fast. Whoever's doing this needs to do this quick. Oh, and Dong Bai is already caught up here. Jesus Christ, he's fast. Jesus Christ, he's fast. We need to build another fire trap here <laughs> to protect us. Let's just ignore her and fix this. See if we can't fix this and make this happen before. Uh, Before this become a serious problem. Mm. Tian Sui, as a result, is not properly defended. Hmm. Within next season, we will figure it out. The year is now 200 of July. But man, this is very painful. Looks like they're good. Looks like these guys got Dongbai under control. That fire trap uh, really did help out quite a bit. Now, our next step. Yeah, 
Battering ram, battering ram, rock throwers. Oh, wait a minute, what the hell is this? That's not good. Hold on a second. How could Zhong Yao not have that ability? That's not normal. Let's do this now. Let's see, battering ram. Hmm. That's strange. I don't have any battering ram ones. What the hell is this? I'm like 39 catapults and the others, but no battering ram. Interesting. These guys will help me take the city. We still have 26,000 troops remaining. So. Oh man, though, none of these guys have any ranks. Guess they'll just have to come as support. Ah, the siege weapons are really empty. Now, to prevent anything weird happening, we do go and block off these points. Got off their boats now, they're coming on land. Well, let me run back and deal with these guys so that they don't cut off our supply routes because I really don't want to deal with anything weird right, right at this time. That would just be unnatural. What's that? Guess we can focus on the battle here. Let's go. Go, go, Baron, buddy. Gonna send troops out. Made it to India. Lich. 
she made to India and got a lot of it done. Throw rocks into the city. Yep. Okay, good. He is in serious trouble now. After what we've just done. And one shell's in there as well. Oh, we threw more rocks in there. <laughs> Alright, Yuan Shao's on the way to destruction. Next turn, Yuan Shao is gonna lose Yi. And I'm gonna cut off this asshole's supply line. That will kill him, automatically. I do not need to do anything special. He'll just be killed automatically. Then I need to send help for Lu Bu immediately, because he's going to be surrounded. But that uh, should not be too bad, I think. Meanwhile, reinforcements are coming this way. Wait a minute, these guys only have a thousand troops apiece? Oh, I forgot to give them uh, extra troops and shit. I better put them back. A thousand troops is not even nearly enough. Let's see if there's anyone who's not busy doing something. Hmm. Well, Zhang Liao could actually come help. Gan Ning could actually come help. Since all my troops are over there, you know what? I have them come over to Chang'an to help out with the situation. It seems like these three that have Dong Bai under control. Now it's just a matter of getting these troops over here. Let's go. Get them over. <clears throat> Probably be the last time I need such shipment because I still need to use these to deal with Tao Chen once uh, he turns. 16 months, 6 months. And the enemy alliance only has 3 months left. Not that it matters, because Yuan Shao's on the way to destruction. Alright, let's see what time it is. Oh shit, it's pretty early. As in, it's pretty fucking late. I'm going to bed. Ah! Let's keep... Uh, let's do this later. Let's do this tomorrow. I think I made significant progress from the last days. Six years, seven years, eight years. Look at this. Look at the way my map just changes. Like, this is the beginning. Capture the central provinces. And I spread like cancer. Yep. Yep. But now I have most of the map. Wonderful. Alright, that's it. Let's talk again tomorrow. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. Until next time.